So one thing you may wonder is why do we need to use expressions that we write manually to, um, to do these things, to connect parameters and channels and, and such. And uh, the answer is obviously beyond the fact that it um, gives you a deeper understanding of how uh, Touch Designer works and how the parameters and the channels talk to each other uh, and just makes you a more powerful, confident user. Uh, there are some practical advantages and one of them that I wanted to show today is just the idea that once you're writing expressions you can start combining them and doing expressions for example within expressions so um, let's do a quick example if I were to put down a constant here and uh, I were to put down LFO for example which I will set to Gaussian so that it doesn't go <coughs> below zero and then let's say I put down a circle sop and I were to say that I'm interested in the radius in X. And so we know that if I wanted to just change the size, I could just go to LFO1, which is the one I'm going to use, channel 0, and uh, the size is going to go from 0 to 1 on the X axis. But now let's say that I wanted to just use this constant and be able to change its value and have that be added. And so actually it's very easy. All I need to do is just combine these operators together. Um, constant 1, channel 0, and then here I go. All I need to do is just change this value and you can see that now it is going to be adding 0 0.61. So this is a very basic and um, example probably that you don't have much use for, but just the fact that you can actually combine these numbers together is something that makes um, writing your own expressions extremely useful. Another thing that you can do is that you can replace certain things, like for example, this uh, channel zero could be replaced by a, uh, a path as well. If you had multiple channels, for example, in this constant, Right now, this channel 1 is, is actually uh, the index 0, but if you had channel 2, channel 3, channel 4, you could, for example, change which channel you're using here by using another expression. So all of these things are useful to know um, how to use when you're trying to do things that don't really come out of the box.